What does that say? That ain't talking about the watches. It, it, you, you're right in a way, but go ahead. I'm going to show you something about that. Go ahead. My people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray and turn for their wicked ways. Then I will hear their, then I will hear their praise, their prayers, and forgive them their sins and heal their lands. That's what you're talking about. Right, you? right. But who is the people? The people that's called by the Lord's name. You see this right here? You say is no Israel. Not no Christians. You don't see you don't see Christians in Chronicles. You don't see that. You're right? right? You're right. You're you don't right. see that at all. This stuff, we make up a lot of stuff. Exactly. And it's because we were taught a lot of lies in, as slaves in America. Absolutely. We were taught a lot of lies, right? Absolutely. So then we start to regurgitate these things. That's why it says my people, you know, take Christians. Right. So what does that mean? My people. That's called by my name. He gave you the plug right there. So the children of Israel, you are child, you're the children of Israel. You was taught that you only you are African American, meaning you come from two white men. That's what that means when you say you're African American or you black. My man, the whole outfit is black. That's what we is. That's what color we is. No, that's a color. We are. What's our nationality? What's our name? What's our heritage? What's our history? Right? We got to get away from. We got to move away from all the garbage that we was fed and lies that we were fed as slaves here, right? So the word Israel, check this out right here, say the 12 tribes of Israel. This word Israel is the name of the Lord. What it means is princes of the powers with God. That's right. That's what that means. Israel has a meaning and that's what it means because we are the sons of the living God. Right. Hold that, give me Psalms and eight, Psalms 83. Give me Psalms 83 and six. I'm gonna show you that. We are the people called by God's name. Not everybody, not those pink people over in the land persecuting, destroying the Palestinians, right. not them. They're the liars. They're the liars. That, that is the devil the Bible speaks. I'll show you them in the Bible. And right. I'll show you Christ called them. Oh, that's the devil over there. Y'all thought that was the, no, no, no. That's the devil over there. I'm gonna show you Christ said that. Said that we are called by the Lord's name, right? The Israelites are called because we are his sons. We are his sons. That's why we are different. We're not like them. Everybody try to make us think, oh, we're all, uh, you're not like everybody else. If you hadn't noticed, only one people suffered the great atrocity called slavery. That's right. The Atlantic slave trade. And before that, if you didn't know, there was the sub-Saharan slave trade. Right. And many more slaveries of which our people, and only our people suffered for thousands of years for thousands we not like regular people that's why we go through things that regular people don't and cannot go through we're not regular has something for you to do because we're, we're used as instruments but when the creator has something for you to do you're gonna do it whether you whether you intentionally do it or do it unknowingly, but you're gonna do what you're called to do. And everything is done according to his time, not ours. According to his what? His timing. His timing. Right. So, you know, you got to go back to how we were created. We were shaped and formed. And then, what allowed us to become a living soul? The breath of life. What's the breath of life? Who created himself. Right. Right? Now you have the breath of life. No, what about I thought you was gonna to touch home with that? Listen, hold it's on. It's the creator himself. What about the creator himself is the breath of life? When he blew the breath of life inside of us to allow us to become a living it's soul. It's, 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 in the, it's in the beginning, in the creation. But mm -hmm. just think about this now. Yeah. Creator allowed me to know this, that it requires skill to understand certain things. You know, it requires skill. Like you said, you can read all the books in the world, but when 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 the Creator gives you something, He gives it to you. The breath of life is God Himself within you. That's why. That's why they call us. That's why they call us. That's why they call us. One verse twenty. I'm gonna show you something. Cause you said it required you right. You a lot of this stuff 
you 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 hint on, but you gotta bring it home. And that's where that's where you have to be, that's where you have to be taught. Now where you coming from is true. It's true. A lot of us we have something in us, and it's a lot of things that we know before anybody actually ever actually say that we believe it. You know what I mean? And that's you you're right in that, but it's but you got that's that's your responsibility after that is to continue your learning. That's the that's the that's the the, uh, the mercy that the Lord, the grace the Lord found on you to give you what you have. But that don't mean squander it or don't develop it. Remember, Christ said He coming back. He looking for that double up on His talent. I mean, on His money. His money is the grace that He gave you. So He looking for you to double up on it. He ain't coming back for the same ticket He left you with. <laughs> you gotta double that up, Supreme. But you know what the Creator said. The Creator said, God, God, Lord. Uh, right. I am the same today, yesterday, and forever. Right. So, again, the breath of life, the energy. The All right, I'm gonna show you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. I'm, I'm about you to keep bring, saying something. You don't bring it home. No, but listen. Go ahead. Listen, I'm gonna listen, listen a little bit more, Supreme. Listen, you, you, you have to understand. Uh, this, see this, now, you he leaving. He, he, he's listening. He's, 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 he's all right. The breath of life. No, he, bro, he might die. The, don't know he gonna come no, 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 no. The breath of life that's allowing me and you to talk to each other. That's not the breath of life. What is it? The breath of life is the laws of God. Bro, that's why I say you keep, yeah, you keep you to you hitting on it, but you're not bringing it home. That's where it requires you to be taught. So that's what that's what because, uh, like you said, a lot of things the Lord gave you. You you didn't necessarily uh, get taught it by anybody, so but you just you got it and you know that it's it's true. And and I'm listening to you speaking. So it's a lot of things that you're saying. It's yeah, so the it's in the Bible. So the but God, hold on, Supreme. But but you have to continue it so that you're not confused, and so that and so that also you can translate to other people because my man standing here he dipped he's like i don't know what the hell he's talking about so yeah i'm gonna leave but he when i was talking he stayed there and my man right there you didn't peep it but it was a brother behind you and the brother right there they both like yeah this is weird i'm leaving i'm telling you i'm putting you on right now bro and this is what's going this is the part you're missing watch this that's what i want the skill of under the lord rain down skill watch this i'm gonna give you what you're missing watch this Sirah, chapter 1 and verse 19. Bring it out. Wisdom, write it down, skill, and knowledge of understanding. So it says wisdom. Wisdom, rain it down. You brought up skill. You spoke about skill, right? Wisdom, rain it down, skill and understanding. Skill and understanding. The skill would be how do you teach a, a, a brother, let's say how you take how you talk to a murderer, how you get him to change his lifestyle, how you deal with uh, 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 our sisters out here, all they want to do is twerk. How do you fix them? How do you turn them from these lifestyles? That's skill. That takes skill. And it requires understanding. Right. That's what it requires. Watch this. Wisdom. Rain it down skill and knowledge of understanding. And exalted them to honor. And that exalted them to honor, meaning gives them. I, when a brother, when, when, when somebody hear you speak supreme and they're like, damn, my man got the wisdom. That's ex you being exalted to honor. This brother's a wise man. When supreme come around, everybody listens. That's you being exalted to honor because you have understanding. That's that right. the Lord rained down on you. Because you can be taught by the nigga up the road. That only know twerking and murder. You can talk to him. He can teach you some things. It doesn't mean that it's understanding or wisdom. You understand? Watch this. And exalted them to honor that hold her fast. Come on. The root of wisdom is to fear the Lord. The root of wisdom is to fear the Lord. Watch this. And the branches thereof are long life. Come on. The fear of the Lord driveth away sin. The fear of the Lord driveth away sins. Now what must you understand to even know if you're in sin, Supreme? Jude. No. Go, go to go the to, book of go Jude. To, go, go to the book of Jude, the last chapter. Read it. Right. Jude chapter only has one chapter, bro. Now until Jude now. only has one chapter. Let me, I'm, I'm going to help you. I'm going to give you the understanding. Hold on, Supreme. I'm going to give you the understanding on what must you understand first before you can say, I must refrain from sin. Right. Give me that. First John, first, first John 3 what, and 4. What is, what is sin? What is sin? That's no, sir. Wrong. Listen. Sin. I'm going to show you what sin is. I'm going to show you what sin is. And this is the part of everything that you know, Supreme. You're not wrong. You just have to bring it home. You just have to understand what you're actually saying. Right? Watch this. First John, chapter 3, verse 4. Because yep. a lot of us get incarcerated, right? 
I'm gonna give for example, right? A lot of us, we go to, we, we, you know what I'm saying, we go sit down for a minute, and when we in there, we got time to learn all type of stuff. And we start regurgitating on the outside when we come home, we start regurgitating that stuff that we heard. We don't, no understanding at all, but we know that it was deep when it was said to us. But we don't have no root. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.